Hello friends, God bless you and welcome. Welcome back to another crock pot recipe. Happy holidays. Friends, welcome back to our crock pot palooza and our host are Miss Jessica Marrows and Tiffany from Small Town Six Channels. And friends, there are a host of creators that will be cooking in this crock pot palooza. Please watch the playlist. Today's recipe is a loaded baked potato. So here, friends, I am going to clean my baked potato with vinegar and water. Now it's not going to be your ordinary baked potato. I am going to cut it up. So I guess you can call this a baked potato casserole if you choose to. But before I cut it up, I'm going to clean it because I am going to leave the skin on. Here, just cut your ends off and just cut your potatoes about I'll say one fourth not too big so I'm going to just cut these four potatoes up thank y'all so much for stopping in and if you're new today I would love for you to like comment and do subscribe so if you try this recipe I would suggest that you do use some crock pot liners and i will leave a link in my description box for that Friends, if you love to do crock pot recipes and you want to jump into this collab, you are more than welcome to. Just get in touch with Miss Jessica Monroe's of Small Town 6, Miss Tiffany. And friends, you're more than welcome. Our next video will be next month, December, the last month of the year, and it's the last wings. So come on and jump in. is not sponsored this is from lisa delight channel and this is her new seasoning a cell that's why i came up with a cell it has your salt not too much pepper garlic powder onion powder and other spices you just use some of cell and you're one and done thank you lisa for a cell so i am going to use the all-purpose one seasoning because I don't need to be using all these season. So if you want to try this, friends, I will leave Miss Lisa channel and link to this seasoning. So let's support one another. So friends, you know I'm cooking in a crock pot and you got to season this really, really extra good. So I'm going to Season this, but don't do it like I did. I cut the thing on and this thing hot. Don't cut your pot on until you season it, okay? But I'm going to go ahead and season this real good. And this is the first time I'm going to use this, Miss Lisa. So thank you so much. And guys, I will give y'all my review. I'm using a cell on my potatoes, but you can use it for meat and anything you desire.
this recipe after you have seasoned your potatoes. Add some butter or you can use some margarine. It's just up to you. Turn your crock pot on high for three hours and go wash them dishes, clean up, whatever you need to do. And three hours later, there you go, guys. It's tender. Wow. And it smells so good. Now it's time for you to cook your bacon. Now I was going to cook it in my oven, but I'm cleaning my oven, so I can't do that. So I decided to put it in the microwave. Now I started out with a foam paper plate and it didn't work but if you could use this use a paper plate paper or a plate so while I got that on I'm going to put my cheese in guys because you know I love me some cheese and just I'm cutting it off and let the cheese melt So the bacon in the microwave took approximately two minutes and then I kept adding 30 seconds afterwards and then I chopped it up and that's it. It's easier if I were to pull out the air fryer, but I did not, okay? So guys, here is my fully loaded casserole baked potato. Now I added some sour cream. You can add some ranch dressing. It's no limit to what you can do. Now I did taste this, Miss Lisa. And I'm telling you, the all-purpose of sell, it really came out tasty. It's well seasoned, guys. So you will not need different seasonings. So let's help Miss Lisa by supporting and buying this product. Let's help one another. Thank you so much, Miss Jessica Marrows and Miss Tiffany Smalltown 6 for putting this together. And there is a playlist. Please do watch another video. God bless you. Love you from Penny and enjoy.